Okay, so moment of truth, we are uh, complete teardown of this block. So first thing I have to do is take the uh, flywheel off, the alternator, the distributor, all that good stuff. Um, transfer port covers, uh, the exhaust covers, which, which is a plight. Uh, Hopefully I can get, get them all out. If I have one that snaps off on me, that's great. But uh, yes, so we are assessing the damage on this block, which I regret, but you know what? I had a blast doing it. So you know what? Let's see what happened. Yes. Okay, so I have the main uh, flywheel nut off. I have a flywheel puller here. Which is very cheap. I'll put the link in the description. But this will pull the flywheel off right here. So that's what's up. Off. Of course, it's attached to the belt. Okay, so I'm gonna produce this uh, right here. It's about an 8, 8 millimeter metric, and uh, we're gonna go for it. I am putting the ring back in here just so we don't lose anything. This is a very great tool, but it got it out very easily. Okay, so now we have uh, the belt loose. So I need to get this distributor, which is fully functioning, and this coil out of here. Okay, how is it going? Okay. All right, stator is loose. I'm gonna put this in my uh, excess package. <coughs> That's going too. Okay. All right. Okay, so. Take the uh, transfer covers off. They're size 11 metric. And we, we are going to go from there. Okay, so I have the uh, transfer port covers, bolts in this bag. So I'm not gonna Transport covers, as you can see, it's gaskets all over this thing, so I have to take all that off. <coughs> but I didn't maintain them in order because this is the excess right here. So, what I'm going to do is take off the uh, I'm not sure if I should take off the cylinder head. I don't think there's any contamination that can happen on that, so I'm going to take off the exhaust bath.
Christmas. Boom. Look how clean that is. See that? Look how clean that is. bolts I believe at least from the uh, the intake manifold here I'm bleeding here just a little bit and these are the tools that, that were required so I'm about to pull this open and uh, see what the, the uh, damage is and hopefully I, I can repair, repair this uh, J block so, as far as I can tell, all the uh, bolts are out. So now we're going to take the uh, the intake manifold off this engine and just to assess what the damage is on the inside. Okay, so all the cylinders they're good except for number three. As you can see the scoring down there, and uh, there's number one 
And you start looking at the pistons. It's a good thing the rings uh, melted into the piston, which would cause heavy scoring. But yeah, so I'm just about to take some uh, some acid to clean up all the melted aluminum and then bore it out and just kind of see where we are as far as what that goes. But hey, you know what? I appreciate you guys for watching. I'm going to get this J-Block back together and get, and get the compression right. And uh, we're going to see you talking again. All right, hey, thanks for watching.